last day, all moved out of the apartment. Dang. Dang. A lot of growth happened here. Chose to rent. When I started, I think it was uh, 865, 875 a month. Now it's 975. So I didn't have any equity going towards home. Could save to invest everything. Decided to start a third party property management out of here. We moved in. We just had half the storage units. I had a desk right there where I made the call on the second storage unit facility to the owner and negotiated the deal right there with them on the phone. And we bought it, turned around, sold it. What, 30 months later, that all happened out of here. Met my fiance here. She didn't live here, but I was living here. A lot of growth happened here. Well, I lived at home till I was 26. What, 26, 27? Because I was always on the road doing Apple Care. And I saved a ton of money. A lot of those decisions changed my life big time. And I wouldn't trade it. Plus, I love my family. I wouldn't trade living somewhere else those years. I wouldn't trade living somewhere else other than here for those three years. Why not? Served its purpose. Good little place. Didn't have to pay for, uh, I think it was this fridge broke. Whew, I didn't have to pay for it. I just called maintenance and said, hey, fridge isn't broken. I think it was my fridge. Name of the stove. I don't remember. It was one of the two, like right when I moved in. <sighs> On to the next thing. On to the next thing. I made a lot of Snapchats, Instagram stories. In the morning, sunrise right through here. Yes, we did. A lot of them. I'm trying to think. What else happened out of here? Grew my apple care business out of here. It paid me a $1,000 a month out of here. And then when I started taking all my time and put it towards real estate, it went down to about three to $5,000 a month. And then good thing I made all those investments and rented this place and saved all that money instead of putting my Avocare money into a home or something else because Avocare income is dawn now, boys and girls. I get zero. But by the end, it really was fun money. I say fun money because, I mean, I'd still save it to invest, but it was money that I would go to Bucks games with or Packer games or, you know, whatever. So, man, a lot of stuff happened here. I had the desk before, it was before we had the office, but I, that's why I had the desk in the uh, the corner over there. Because, you know, I never planned on starting a property management company. So I would work out of here or uh, parents' house or one of the veterinary clinics a handful of years ago. Out of the offices there. And then we decided to get the property management company. So I was sitting right here when I found out that... The one property management company that was managing the buildings for us was stealing from us. And that the vacancy skyrocketed and they were not telling the truth with certain things. Had fun times here, had hard times here, happy times, sad times. And it seems like longer than two and a half or three years. I know that. That's for sure. You got a lot of time in the day. It depends on what you do with those seconds and the decisions that you make in that day. And that'll determine what your next year, two years, three years, four years, five years can be like. And I know that three years from now, your 2023 can be a lot different than your 2020 if you want it to be. If you make decisions and then act on those decisions and run with it. So checking out for the last time from the apartment. See ya.